This is Liberty Stock number 51352. It's a 16 inch by 32 inch Okamoto ACC 1632DX. Serial number 69422, new 2019. Uh, it's got the 16 by 32 electromagnetic chuck. Got a coolant filtration system, manual over the wheel dresser. Um, this is all original paint. Um, it's just in that beautiful condition. Rodney? Yes. Are we ready here? Yeah. Show a little bit of the machine. You get off to either side, just can't completely get around it, so. Oh, it's running. I forgot I left the hydraulics on, so the oil's running already. Got the leads for the uh, coolant system right there, which is off to the side here. Okay. Pump's running, that's about it. Yeah, so we're going to walk there. through or walk around. No, walk you're... around. Yeah, go walk to the other side. Okay. Lower controls for traverse grinding, all down there. Lock is off, I think, so we can play with it. Yeah. Saddle lock. Standard controls. Okamoto's venerable. How long have they been using this, huh? That works well. Another thing, you can open up the electric panel. There's not much else to look at on the side here. Just the following cord for the uh, chuck. And uh, yeah, that's about it. We can show you some of the panel here. That's my temp line coming in here, low voltage, as I spill my coffee all over the floor and the machine. There we go. That's good. Yeah. All right. I'm making a mess here. Continuing on. So uh, a couple of manual items here, the hand wheels, manual dresser. As you can see, so this guy is back and forth. Yeah. And of course the hand wheel. We've got it all the way down. Uh, for in chain, bring this in, it all works nice. So bring that back out. Table, same thing. Looks good. Uh, oil, is the oil up? Yeah, I can probably show the oil up on the column. That's nice. That's right where it should be. It's clean, nice, clean lubricating oil if you want to zoom in on that. It's an important feature of any machine. And that said, we can uh, power up the spindle. Just, I think I can run the spindle. That's right, the oil's on now, but it's, it's quiet enough where you can hear the spindle. So okay. we'll power the spindle up by itself here. Just listen to that for a minute. <coughs> this sounds real nice. I think we're going the right way here. Yep. There's the diamond nib. So that sounds good. We can leave it on or... Shut it off either way. Uh, that said, I can bring the table on. I'm kind of preset on my speed already. I'm just going to give it a direction over here. I haven't programmed, any, programmed anything yet. God, I can't talk. There we go. Moving along. And we get over here. We slow it down, of course. It's all hydraulic at this point. Of course, speed it up. That's good. That's nice. That said, we can just kind of leave it at an easy speed here. Maybe do a quick plunge cycle or something. Uh, so you got that on. Spindle, we don't really need it on right now. It's fine. We'll leave the oil on. We'll go to a plunge cycle speed at both ends. Uh, and this, of course, is programming mode. We'll give it, reset. I want 10 thousandths. 10 thousandths program. I'm taking off 1,000 course. 1,000, uh, transition is 1,000, and we'll take off two tenths on the fine speed. So when we get down to 1,000, we'll go two tenths at a time. Uh, before we do that, I can show the hand wheel, man. I'm just bouncing around here. That's point one, see? Right there. Uh, one would be one tenth, and half a thousandth. That all works real nice, too, for bringing the wheel down. So I'm going to reset again, reprogram it at 10, because where did I leave it at? A, I'm too tall for this thing. Here we go. Ten. So we're going to do ten. And uh, we'll run a cycle. Do I want to do rapid? We'll do rapid once real fast. As long as we're in here playing with the buttons. There's rapid. I'm going to hit it. Watch the wheel going up over here. There's rapid. Up on the collar. Oh, the, sorry. the wheel. Yeah, get up high. Yeah. I'm going to park the table. There. Uh, here's down. 
That's rapid. That works nice. There we go. And that's good enough for now. And uh, yeah, this is all uh, coolant on and it, mist collector on. We've already got oil on. And this is direction for the table when I start off. This is the park control. We went through this. This is all part of the cycle. So now we can turn the table back on. Reset out of this. I'll uh, call for 10 thousandths. Where did I leave it at? Right here we go. 10 thousandths. Is that 10? There we go. 10. And just go. Just go. When you put it into auto cycle, it goes 1,000 at a time. Watch here. You won't, you won't see it at the wheel, but we're going down 1,000 at each pass. I can change it over to one pass here. Just one side only. Not here. Here. Right. So both of those work. And uh, let's go back to double. Two. One, now we're going to two tenths, you go down to eight. Two tenths at a time. Uh, do I have a, oh, I have a spark out on there too, one spark out. So when we hit zero, that thing will tra traverse one more time for the spark out and then park itself home. Here's our spark out. There's home. And so same thing again, all I have to do really to duplicate that is give it another 10 thousandths, send the table in and put it in auto mode and it'll just count down instantly, just like that. We'll finish this. I'll do a quick traverse drying and we can kind of watch what's happening up here if you want. It only takes a minute. So, okay. I'll speed it up. I'll speed up my whole program. Let's go faster. There we go. Into tenths. Spark out, spark out. Let's give it two spark out passes. One, two, and home. Now we're just going to go over to same program. We'll give him another 10 thousandths. Now Traverse takes longer. We'll, ah, 10. Ah, we'll do 10. I don't care. And over to Traverse Grind. Turn the table on and flip it over to Auto Cycle. Now we jump into this whole business over here. I believe it's in neutral right now. This is incremental. That's continuous. And this is the amount of incremental right here. I think it's set OK. Let's see what we get here. Come on up on the dial here so you can see. Because this floats. This is our incremental. And the whole table, the whole carriage is moving at this point, so. Now you should see that reverse in a minute. We've got, I've got them set pretty tight, I think. I'm going the wrong way. I have to send it the other way. So I forgot I played with the hand wheel. Hang on a minute here. Let me go this way. Hang on. Hang on, hang on. we got to get back in between the magnet on the switch. Give me one second here. It's over here when these are set. I was already on the other side of the switch. Let me get this in. I forgot I brought it all the way out here. Right above. There we go. I'm going to reach over. Let's try that again. And yeah. Now we should see the reverse. And I can open that up a little bit too, probably. Yeah, there's a bunch. Yeah, the reverse, see? We'll go back and forth, maybe an inch. And of course, that's incremental. See? Almost there. And then when we get off the incremental, that's more than an inch, isn't it? Yeah, it's going a ways. Somebody moved the dogs here. I think we were playing with this thing yesterday. I'm going to put it on continuous in a second anyhow, as soon as it reverses. There it is. And here's this. Now I want to flip over into neutral and then we go continuous. And you'll see, see the dial. Now this is a, it turns into a speed control. Here, come back, come back up here now. I'm going slow here. And really it's just a hydraulic speed control. And it'll do the same thing. It'll traverse back and forth. Notice how when it stops, it waits for the table to finish its one reset so that you don't be moving on top of the cart. Yeah, well it's pretty, it knows. It waits for the switch to make. And then all this time we've been feeding down, every traverse will drop down one, of course. That's that that's the same 10 thousandths feed that I've got going. You can see the whole thing moving. Pretty, now you can see it. Incremental, it's, it's hard to see, but we're going pretty fast. I think it's going a little bit faster even. Huh? See how fast this thing moves? Yeah, I think it moves. Yeah, we're grinding now. <laughs> Traverse grind down to three, but yeah, I mean, you know, so if we flip over to uh, vertical, I think that shuts that off, see? And now we're on vertical, and it's going to 
finish off the plunge grind, just to finish off the cycle. Oh, this will be here all day. And it should park, I guess, after a couple of uh, spark out recips. Yeah, there it is. That's excellent. And uh, right. yeah, that's how it all works. Shut off the oil, maybe, and uh, you can hardly hear this thing on. That's a nice machine. Excellent tool. We're done here.